Hey, Francois Boudreau here with Carlisle HVAC. Today we're going to take a look at splicing duct connector. Now your first step is to measure one and a half inches from the edge of that connector. Now that's equal to approximately five tooth marks on that seam. You then want to cut a notch and then cut right along the edge of that offset seam. Once you've taken out the notches on each side, what you're left with is a piece of connector that can then mate up to the other section. Ready? Yeah. You then want to spot weld those sections together. Now if you're doing this in the field, you're basically just going to be screwing those two sections together. The next step is going to be to glue that flap of fabric. We're going to be using a splicing adhesive, specifically designed for Hypalon and neoprene connector. Notice how we're applying the adhesives to both sections of fabric. Once that's done, we're going to use a metal roller and apply some pressure to ensure we get a nice solid bond. Here we're using some 1402 rolled sealant in order to seal up the metal section of that seam. So there you have it, a completely leak-free splicing seam for your connector. Now make sure to visit us at www.carlislehvac.com for more videos or more information.